Hey everybody, Luke back once again from the Core Cars News office this time, not the tech lab, giving you a quick look at how to manage your subscriptions for Roku. One of the most common emails I actually get to our contact us email address is, hey, I'm getting billed to Roku and I don't understand why I'm getting billed charges every month from Roku. Well, it's probably because you subscribe to a streaming service through your Roku device and it's being managed by Roku. Now, I don't have any currently, but I'm gonna show you if uh, we did where to go and how to cancel them or just to see what you have in case maybe your kid signed you up for some subscriptions you weren't aware of. It happens. First though, before we get into this quick tip of the day, if you like what we do here, hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up. We break down everything happening in the world of cord cutting with daily news videos Monday through Friday, reviews, how-to guides, and quick tip videos just like this one. All right, I'm gonna pull a link to this page. This is the my.roku.com slash subscriptions page. In here, you would see everything you're currently subscribed to if you are. You would also be able to cancel through this. Now, since I don't have anything, it's suggesting that we subscribe to different things from Netflix to Sling TV, Hulu, Disney Plus, and more um, managed and built through Roku. Uh, you can easily click right here and you would be able to cancel it. Again, I'm gonna put a link to this in the show notes, log into it through your computer, just log into your Roku account. If you don't remember your password, there is a recover password, but clicking that link will ask you to log in if you're not currently logged in. And then you'll be able to see everything you're currently subscribed to and how to cancel it. It's literally just that simple. It's very easy. The best way to do this though is through a browser on your phone, tablet, laptop. That's the best way to do this rather than on the Roku device. Where do there go? I wasn't kidding when I said quick tip of the day. Link in the show notes, link in the first pinned comment. Just go here. And if you see something subscribed to you don't want to, have, you can easily cancel it. I will say though, Roku is very nice to manage your subscriptions through. Amazon and Apple and others also do this, but it's really nice ability to have all these in one spot to quickly add them or drop them without needing to create multiple accounts. If you have a question, leave me a comment, let me know. I'd love to hear from you. Until next time, take care, be safe. I'll talk to you all again real soon.